Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is Alexis here. It has been a little bit since I uploaded any new content because with this whole state of unpleasantness and emergency and reworking how you live your life, my husband has started teleworking most days. So we decided that we were going to split our offices and convert our guest room into a makeshift office for him to use whenever we don't have guests. Um, so we have been, I mean, we painted and you can kind of see that we painted and I think it was in a previous video that I uploaded, but we've completely redone it. We've added things. I've changed the layout and I just want to show you guys what I did. So let's get started. So first things first, this is my desk space. A lot of this stuff did stay the same. We just moved it right back in after we were done painting. We have Dumbo up there, Sleeping Dumbo from Big Top Souvenirs in New Fantasyland. And then just all of my stuff kind of made it back to where it was. This is new. I got this from Walmart. I think it's a Mainstays, like one of their um, generic brand. It's not like Better Home and Gardens, but it's pretty. And this has all of my camera stuff. So typically, when I'm not filming, the camera is in here. I also have all of the stuff for our Osmo, any little extenders that I have, all of that goes in there. And if I can fit that back in as nicely as I found it, that'd be great. Awesome. And then everything pretty, oh, on this side of the room pretty much stayed the same. I did a little bit of reorganizing and added some things. This is probably one of the coolest things ever. Let me flip it around. This is Sirius Black's wand. Okay, this is Sirius Black's wand. I got it from the Universal Orlando back in 2012 when we went to both. There it is. It's real size. If you've ever been to Diagon Alley or Hogsmeade, you know that they sell them. They're already pre-made. They're real wood, which is better than what you can get if you buy like a costume one. So that he has his spot right here, like that. We have the mini, um, the Minnie Mouse main attraction series. It's not complete. It's not even up to date because I can't get everything. We have my bulletin board, which is probably my favorite thing in here. Um, it's been the backdrop of a lot of my videos. I have all of our pins, the keys that Disney. That, Shop Disney did a couple of times. My mouse ears. And then we kind of just added some storage. I had, I've had this for a while. It was actually in my college dorm room. This is where all of my equipment, my big equipment will go. And then I got this bookshelf from Target. It is part of the Room Essentials line. I will put a link in the description box below to that if you're interested. We have The Lion King, which again has been around for a while. I got it at Disney this past time when we went in December. I got it in the gift shop at the Art of Animation Hotel where we stayed. And then this is just some of my favorite Disney things that I've collected over the years. We have the entire series of Kingdom Keepers, which if you haven't read them yet, I mean, they're technically young adult fiction. I still really much enjoy them. They're kind of futuristic, there's, not futuristic, they're scientific, they include a lot of the th things that we love about Disney, like the parks and Disney Springs and all that stuff. So if you haven't checked those out, definitely do so. We have my countdown, which I think is a day or two off, so we're gonna ignore that. This stuff, quite possibly my favorite thing that I have is on this next shelf, so this, is my Disney's Treasures books. It is about as old, ooh. It is about as old as me, not quite. And it has from the Seven Dwarfs up until Pocahontas. So you can see how old it is. And it's falling apart, but I have had this since I was little and it is probably one of my most prized possessions. 
And then in this storage container, which is also mainstays from Walmart, we have all of my extra ears. The ears that are not being used on the bulletin board or just a place to keep them when I'm not in the parks. Then we have a little lucky stuffed animal from Shop Disney. And then just a couple of my baby blankets. We did add curtains. Let me see if I can get these in full effect. They are so pretty. And we did have to go a little high because they're longer than I expected. But it does give an illusion that the, the window is bigger. I got these curtains from Target. I don't know if they're available online, but I will put a link to them on the Target website in the description box below. And then because this is the room that I do all my filming, when we do get to go back to Disney, this will be where I do all my packing videos. As you can see, I have my park bag, which is Lounge Fly. 101 Dalmatians. I've talked about this in other videos. I love it so much. And then in here we just have a couple of our essentials. That is going to be my husband's park bag. So really any of the bigger bags that we take to Disney will be in that one. This will have all of the kind of cosmetic travel bags like that. Let's see if I can get that back in. Okay. And then this will ha has our packing cubes in it, all ready to go and all nice and organized for when I get to film my packing videos again. And then we mounted a TV in here and I've had this for a while. I got it at Hobby Lobby last year. It was part of their Springs collection and I love it. It is a map with a hundred acre wood. So that is everything we did to the office to make it mine and make it pretty and make it a great place to film more content so that is all for this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did please be sure to give this a big thumbs up if you have not yet done so please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell notification icon to be notified every time i upload new content